Hello everyone, welcome to our channel and today we will see how we can delete messages really fast on Discord and also we can delete bulk of messages in just one go and by clicking just once. So let me first clear up some things like you can only delete your messages when in private chat and you can delete all the messages of all the people if you have the permissions while you are in a server. So you cannot delete everyone's messages while in server if you don't have the permission. So let's see how we can do it. So first of all go to Google and search for discord delete all messages in a discord channel or DM. And then you will see this website from gist.github.com and just click on this sub link which is also by github and its name is undiscord delete all messages in discord channel or DM. So click on it, open it up and this is how it will look like. So after scrolling down a little bit you will be able to see these steps and in these steps just follow them. So the first step is we need to get browser extension and get it according to your browser and since I have Chrome so I will get temper monkey for my browser which is Chrome and let's add it. Click on add to Chrome then click on add extension and it got added to your extensions and for you to see it you can just click on your extensions and pin temper monkey and it will appear without even clicking on extensions so now go back to the website and here the second step is get either greasy folk or open user js so i'm getting greasy folk and here you will see this option of install this script at the top just click on it and install it and this is the source code of this script so we don't have to do anything but just click on this install button at the top and it is added let me tell you one more thing that whatever we are doing it is against discord's terms of service but Discord has never banned anyone using this process or this method so don't be afraid about it and even if you feel like your privacy might get compromised so for that just change your password after this process and we will also see how we can remove all these extensions and things that we are installing right now so after getting your extension and then installing undiscord open up your discord on browser and not on app this is quite important so go to your browser and search for discord on google and then open it up so after opening discord you will be able to observe this additional option of bin here in the top right corner and this is what we were looking for and these are the things that we were doing so on the extensions you can see temper monkey and here you can disable undiscord and also when you click on dashboard you can delete undiscord from here so there's no need to worry about the things that we did you can easily remove them so let's get back to discord and here let me tell you one more thing before starting our process so for that go to your discord settings and in the advanced settings please make sure that you enable the developer mode so we can get individuals discard IDs and use them for our process. So after enabling it go back and here when you right click a person you can see that there is a copy ID option that will appear now after enabling the developer mode and this is what we will be using. So go to bin and here all you have to do is just click on me and it will fetch the author ID itself. It is your ID and then click on current and it will fetch the server ID and channel ID and it is different for different servers and channels so use it that way and by clicking on filter you can filter out all the words that you want to delete in your entire chat so just type in that word and click on start and you will be able to do that it can be a link a file or anything else and it is quite easy you can also select interval of messages by clicking on select and here this plus icon will appear and this is the after message 
suppose I click here and this will add a ID here for this and then click on select for before and click on this icon and then it will delete all the messages between these two intervals and that's how it happens now we also have this filter of date where you can specify the dates between which you want the messages to be deleted and this is also a useful feature after that there's advanced settings you don't have to touch it make sure that you keep it on default and now let's try this tool up so select and let me select this here and for the before message let me select this here and then click on start and this process has just started and after analyzing it has given us a preview of the messages that it will be deleting so we can just preview them and click on ok and it will automatically delete them if the number of messages is quite high the process might stop in between but you don't have to worry about it it is because you might appear as a bot to the Scott server and it slows down the server so to keep the server running smoothly for everyone else it might get stuck in between but this app and this process will optimize itself and make sure that all the messages will be deleted on their own and it will catch up the pace with it so just sit down and relax and let this process happen on its own and that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful and if you still find any problem you can always comment down below and our team will be happy to help you. If this video helped you make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos.